quite frankly, if the owner of a dog does not have insurance, it poses a grave problem to our case. As in any other personal injury case that we may have, if there's no insurance, the ability to recover is limited. We would have to go after personal assets of the owner of the dog to satisfy our injury claim. In dog bite cases, sometimes if the individual is a renter, we can actually look to get at the insurance policy of the owner of the premises. If the owner knows or in the exercise of reasonable care should know that a dog that they are renting to essentially through their owner uh, has a vicious propensity, we can look to the insurance company for the owner of the premises as opposed to the owner of the dog to satisfy our injury claim.